In a world where gamers have infinite choices at their fingertips, one man seeks to uncover the crap and find the ultimate gems, to denounce deception and explore the creative new world ahead. His name is Josh, and Josh plays. Hey guys, welcome back. This is our first episode of part of a Let's Play series called Atari Arcade Origins. If you haven't already, do me a huge favor to like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel so you don't ever miss an upload as soon as those go up, please. Anyways, today we're going to be starting a new series on Atari, and we're going to look at the absolute class, and some you may have heard of, some may have been right past the hidden gems, if you will. And today, I'd like to start off with a personal favorite of mine. It's a game called Food Fight. Well, Food, Food Fight is an arcade game that was developed by the General Computer Corporation and released by the Atari Incorporated in March of 1983. The player guides is Charlie Chuck, who is trying to eat an ice cream cone before it melts, but while avoiding four chefs that are bent on stopping him. 1,951 arcade cabinets were sold at the time. In Food Fight, the player controls a boy named Charlie Chuck, and the object of the game is to eat an ice cream cone that's located on the opposite side of an open play field. The ice cream cone is slowly melting, and it must be consumed before it melts completely. Controls consist of an analog position, joystick, and a button. Well, that's the gist of it, and... I think we should get started. Why not? Thank you for tuning in. Let's get going. <clears throat> Insert a coin. Okay. Okay. So I get the pie. Throw it at him. Let's get the cone. But see, you can get more points if you're patient and you accrue cones. And you kill the shifts. Oh, I fell. See? Don't want that to happen. Get some of the nanners. See, they have the ability to do the same. Oh! You don't want to get too greedy with it. That's the problem. Alright, so I'm going to go for the ice cream quicker this time. Okay, so let's advance through here. And by the way, these all the ones we'll be doing in this series will be direct ports of the arcade version, the arcade cabinet. Nice, level two, level three, let's do this. And I, I guess the objective of this is just to shine a light on, like, you know, some of the games that would have frequented... The early set, oh, I'm sorry, the mid 70s, the late 70s, and early 80s of the arcade scene that Atari helped to find so much of, you know? And uh, that's why I felt like this would be a fun little, maybe 10, 15 part series. Very short uh, episodes. Oh! Crap. Game over. I think we can do a couple more. Let's do this again. Okay. But again, I've always thought this uh, food fight was an underrated little gem. And I think it could be fun to explore some more of these as I uh, go along. Maybe some like Lunar Lander, uh, stuff like that. Get that 
ice cream cone. And then those at home, you probably get this on the eShop or a digital store. See how you compete compared to my score. Have fun with it. Oh, he got me, got me, got me good. Right. Noise. Crap. Oh! Not right. One more, guys. We'll do one more. Gosh. Go for the ice cream cone. Screw it. Terrible. Ah! Uh, I think I have one more in me. I actually enjoy fish fight. Oh my god! Take it. Come on!
Anyways, guys, that'll wrap up. That's my wake up food fight. That's why we're doing this series. You probably haven't heard of it, but now you have. Know your roots. See you next time.